I started in the construction industry when I was younger. And I like the fact that, you know, um, the construction part is, you, you see your product develop. And to me, that's what I like. You're, di you're dealing with different contractors, different craftsmen and different levels of, of knowledge on the field. Well, construction in any in any particular setting, there's there's always going to be some dangers. I don't know. Does he need to be in there right now? Does he need to be in there while this is being pulled? Yeah, I don't think he really needs to be in there either. Because um, I was thinking about that. Because there's a lot of pressure there. If something happens, he's in there. You know, he's in the middle, getting struck by by something. So maybe if he doesn't have to be down there. You know, why, why, why take the risk and put him down? Maybe he just needs to get out. Safety is very important. We deal with a lot of uh, dangerous gases and a lot of dangerous e equipment, hard hats, uh, safety glasses, gas monitors, masks. Uh, you saw them cutting some fiberglass earlier. They have special masks for that kind of thing and special training from Caesar for all that stuff. I've been around um, for some time in the construction industry, and I've seen, I've seen some serious incidents. I've seen, um, I've seen a fatality where a guy was electrocuted. Um, something very simple where um, it could have been eliminated had he followed the proper procedures. I actually had to perform some CPR, and that is something I always think about, and that is something that I think that drives me uh, to keep the guy safe. How Caesar's approachable, they're just as approachable. You could go talk to them about anything. You could, you, they could take care of us. They'd, they'd do anything in the world for us. And, and that's what makes it a special work in here, is being able to have that, right? Being able to go in and say, hey, you know what? I'm having some issues at home. I'm having some family issues. You know, my kid's really sick. Or, you know, my kid had a bad day in school. You know what, go take care of your family. They're very family orientated. That's what they are and, and they allow us to be the same way. Caesar does a great job. He comes down here and he, he does hands-on and he's always with the superintendents or the foremans and making sure that they're, they have their safety meetings and uh, he's always giving us a little surprise to check on us and yeah, and you know, we, we, uh, he does a good job on making sure that we're, we're safe. Well, like I said, it, it leans back to the, we're not afraid of him. Like most safety guys, oh, the safety guy's coming, watch out. You know, make sure all your stuff's in a row. But that's, that's not him. He, he doesn't come in to, to you know, like a, a mean parent. He comes in to be more of a, a, a compatriot, part of your crew, to help you out and get it run, done right and keep everybody going home safe. Um, that I don't get a phone call from, from the guys with an injury or with an incident, it, that's, that's a good day. You know, we had a incident-free day, um, no injuries, no utility hits, nothing like that. that that's a, a really good day for us. Every time I talk to somebody out there, and I, I, I really want them to go home to their families.